Hey guys, me Johnny Crims 2000 here, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Grand Theft Auto 3. Man, it's been a while since I've actually touched this. I think it's been about two weeks. So uh, I apologize for you guys who have been looking, uh, waiting to for me to continue on with this series. But uh, as I have said in some of my previous videos, that I have been extremely busy with things and uh, you know with life and with other Let's Plays and particularly with me trying to finish my Tony Hawk Underground Let's Play and with um, some of my other projects that I have here and there. So anyway, uh, it's been a while since I've actually played this, so I don't actually remember where I left. Ooh, okay, okay, you're just gonna... Ooh, that's a lot of money, actually. Let me... Technically, that wasn't my fault, but I will get the money anyway, so... You know, because you don't want that to go to waste, after all. So... Let's go ahead and just start here. Now, I do remember that I took missions from this building here, so let's go... Actually, before I go over there, I really want to get another car because this car is pretty banged up. I don't want this thing to blow up halfway through a mission. So, let's go ahead and see if we can... Um, I, I, I really want to go ahead and uh, attempt to finish this let's play off pretty soon and by soon I mean as soon as possible because quite frankly I don't know how long how much longer this this you know this let's play is going to last really because I don't know how far along I'm in you know I'm in the game um, as I've mentioned many times before I've never actually completed this game so you guys are gonna see me hopefully um, finish this game and complete this game for the very first time in my life so that's always exciting. Oh, damn it. Alright, so now we have a new car. It's not as good as my old car, but you know what? It, at least it's still intact. So, again, I don't know how long it's going to take me to finish this game. I hope it's... I hope I'm fairly, you know, far along where I can uh, be comfortable enough saying that this, this Let's Play is going to be over and done with pretty soon. I don't know why people are shooting at me, but... I need, I'm trying to get into that A. Now this is the one thing that I, I don't know if I mentioned this before in previous parts, but one of the things that, oh, okay, somebody blew up my tire, damn it. I don't know if I mentioned this in previous parts, but one of the things that I don't like about this game um, is that when whenever you hit something with your front bumper, with the front of your car, I think that guy's going to start shooting me, yeah. You, your hood, the hood of your car goes up like it opens up and uh, I don't like that because in, in in other GTA games actually there was no need for me to damn it I, I all right whatever I'm over here wasting time getting a new car and there's just like really fancy cars right there right uh, right there for me to just get so whenever the hood of your car opens up in my opinion it, it doesn't it, do, it, it be, makes seeing where you're going slightly difficult now it's not terribly terribly inconvenient but it is somewhat of a uh, of a pain Miguel seems to think I'm mistreating him still he's revealed the extent to which Catalina fears your quest for revenge oh boy <laughs> she has this girl's crazy started around Liberty whose sole job is to hunt you down act as the bait and get the death squads to follow you to Pipe Creek. Oh, hell. Where some of my men will be waiting for them. At least we have some backup, at least. Oh. Although I'm not exactly sure how... Oh, boy. Alright, so we have to... I don't know... Alright. Now, I mentioned before how this... this uh... Oh, damn it. The, the cops are still after me. Which is not good. I mentioned I've mentioned before how this game oh hell. <laughs> this game isn't really my forte, as it were, meaning I am not exactly uh, an expert at this. I'm fairly confident, you know, I'm fairly um, comfortable with games like um, with uh, Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Vice City I've actually completed num numerous times. In fact that was the let's play that I did before this, if you uh, if you don't know. But uh, you know that game and Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Those two games are, you know, those two games I'm I'm very very comfortable completing and uh, playing around. This game, 
you know, again, I have never beaten it, so I, I, I don't know what this mission calls for. I don't know if I'm doing things right. And especially, especially, because I know I mentioned this before a lot of times, but you guys have no idea just how much of a pain it is that you don't have an in-game map. Like right now, I have no idea where I'm at. I don't have no idea where I'm going, and there's no in-game map to, to, to help me. I actually had to pull up a, um, a map. You know, I have a map right here on my computer screen that I have with me in case I need it because there's just no map like right now I don't know where the hell I'm going I don't know I see the blips on the screen but I went that way and there's nothing over there oh come on so this is one of the many reasons why I'm I'm, I'm, I'm really see I'm, I just made a huge I think I just made a huge u-turn here or not a U-turn, like a, I, I went in like a huge circle. See, like right here, I don't know. I, I see the pink. I see the yellow. But I don't understand where I need to go. See, I feel like I've already been here already. All right, so I, I went right. So let's go left. I think I have to cross this bridge here. Ugh. So I, I know that this game was sort of like a big hit when it first came out, but this... I know I'm probably going to anger a couple people when I say this. This game has not aged very well. Um, I mean, it's still fun, sure. But having... Again, I, I've told the story before about how I I started Grand Theft Auto as, as far as like the, the, the 3D games. I started with Grand Theft Auto Vice City. That was the first Grand Theft Auto game that I really, you know, really played and, and beaten and things like that. And having gone from that to, to this, it's very, very jarring, you know. And again, I, I cannot stress enough just how annoying it is that I don't have a map. Like right here, I'm going around in circles. I don't know where to go. I don't know where a bridge is. Like I just passed it, but I don't know where it is. Because again, you don't have any kind of indication to tell you that, yes, you're going to be passing by a bridge. See, there's a bridge right there, but it's going the complete opposite way of where I want to go. So I don't know where am I going. Like I don't... All right, I think there's another bridge over here. I think. If you guys don't know what I'm trying to do here, yeah, see there, there's this bridge. All right, let's try to get on this bridge. I think I'm going the right way. Okay, so here it is, but we have to go to the right, I think. Yeah, I mean, if you guys want to know, this is one of the main reasons why I just never got into this game. Part, I mean, partly, I, I do blame, I, I recognize the fact that it is because I kind of started off. See, where the hell is the bridge? Oh, what the hell? Come on. I'm spending so much time doing something that shouldn't take this long. But I am, because this game is stupid. The infrastructure of this of the city is just plain horrible. Okay, seriously, I just passed. Okay, I need a. Excuse me, ma'am. I need your vehicle. Okay, so. Uh, okay, here's the bridge. I am standing like I am standing right underneath the bridge, right? You guys see that, right? All right, I'm going left. There's nothing over there. I'm turning another left, but there's no bridge over here. What the hell? And my car is still here. See, I just passed. Where the fuck is this bridge? I need to get on this bridge. My god. This infrastructure is just annoying as hell. Alright, here we go, here we go. After freaking 10 minutes of looking around. God damn it, this game is so bad. I mean, it's not a bad game. Let, let me let me correct myself. It's not a bad game. The, the, the design of it is just horrible. Like, if you're going to give us this huge world to explore, give us a damn map. Unless there's something I'm completely omitting here. You know, that I'm missing out on. Alright. 
So I'm, I'm heading over here towards the pink blips. I have no idea what the hell I'm going to do. It's I have a kill whatever, apparently. But I don't know what that means. Okay, there's a pink blip over here. Okay, so I guess I'm... Alright, alright. This guy's just... Okay. Yeah. Come on. Oh, God. Oh! Camera. Camera. God. Oh, come on. Just blow up. There it is. He should blow up. He should blow up. He should blow up. Booyah. What? You failed to... Oh, my God. All right, whatever. We got to load it. There's no point in going all the way back. Jesus, this game is horrible. <laughs> Uh, or, or or let me again. I don't want to. I don't want to get the hate the hate squad on me. This game is not horrible, but there are definitely things that just don't work. For starters, it's stupid. Just utterly, you know. Ooh, excuse me. Just utterly stupid that you don't have a map. I can't stress to you guys just how dumb of a decision that was and I know what some of you guys may say like oh there's a map that was included in the packaging or whatever that doesn't count all right because you're not always gonna have the map right in front of you if you have a game like this you should have the map right in front of you you know or not in front of you but like you should have you should be able to just just get the map and then have it in the game Ugh, this is so dumb all right, God damn it! See, this is the reason why it's taking me so long to to finish this damn let's plays because it would be so much easier if we just had a damn map. And now, for some reason, we don't have cars over here. And okay, I was about to say like, and now my car disappeared. Wonderful. All right, let's try to do this again. I wonder how long it's gonna take us to find the damn bridge this time. Oh my God! I can't tell you guys just how. Uh, this game. I really don't like this game. I know it's a classic, and I know in retrospect, you know, it, it, was, a, it was definitely a huge accomplishment, but man, it, it just has so many flaws. So many, so many very, very glaring flaws. See, like, right here, I'm supposed to get on that bridge, but now I'm lost again. I don't know how to get on it. Oh my god. Alright. Excuse me. Alright, I think it, I think it's over here. No, it's over there. I think. No. Okay, now. Okay, here we go. See, I had to go over grass just to get on this. Does that make sense to anybody? <laughs> Seriously, does that make sense? Okay, I think I know what I'm supposed to do here. I think. I think I'm supposed. I'm not supposed to blow them up. I think I'm supposed to just get them to chase me. I think. The only problem is, I know where one of them is, but there's three of these sons of my mother f whatevers, and I have to make them chase me. But the only problem is, you guys saw how long it took just for me to j just find the first one. I have to find three of these guys. Finding one with this system without a map is already annoying as it is. What the hell? All right. There's one over here, I think. I swear to God, I hope they're all on this island. I hope everything's on this island because if if it if it okay here it is. I have them chasing me. I think yeah they're chasing me. Now right, we gotta go this way. I think they're like right on my ass too. I have no idea where I'm going. I'm just kind of I'm just kind of swerving and stuff pretending that I know where to go even though I don't where the hell am I going excuse me sir camera camera oh what the hell Ugh. god damn it this game is so stupid Ugh. <laughs> 
I hate this game. Just give me a damn map. Um, for those of you who are just joining me, hello. <laughs> I'm having quite a bit of difficulty with this mission. Or rather, this game in general. Why is... Alright, there it is. I don't like the camera being that close to my ass. I don't feel comfortable. Um, yeah. As you guys can tell, I'm having quite a bit of difficulty with this game. And the main culprit is because we don't have... You don't have a camera in this... In, not a camera. Map. Um, I know I'm sounding like a broken record player. I know I'm like complaining about the same thing over and over again. But seriously though, you guys have no idea. Like When you have a map or an open world, an open sandbox such as this, you really need a map. It's something that's so glaringly missing from this game that it's it, it makes it not fun. Um, you guys may be wondering, well, how, why not? Well, because there's this game, the visual style of, of Vice City... While it is pleasing to the eye as far as, you know, just going around, doing anywhere, doing uh, doing anything, that is fun. But when you don't know where you're going, like, there's no, there's really no big landmarks here besides a few. So it's very, very easy to get lost, especially with the fact that a lot of these roads, like the infrastructure, the actual infrastructure of Liberty City is just really really bad I don't care what anybody says this the, the the infrastructure in this game is just terrible because most of the time you don't know where you're going and roads lead to nowhere or there's certain parts where you swear to, you swear that there should be a bridge there and there isn't like right here I have to go on this bridge this bridge that I'm passing under right now I have to go on that bridge but as far, to my knowledge, there's really nothing that is, you know, you have to go into this little corner right here, turn into it, turn another right, go in this little loop thing, and then finally you're on the bridge. That makes no sense. I know that it's supposed to be based off of New York, and maybe New York has an infrastructure as terrible as this. But seriously, like, there's, it, it really, really gets on your nerves, and it really drives the point that you really need a, a map for this thing. For those of you who don't know, no, you don't have a map. You have a little radar at the bottom left of your little screen, but that doesn't make that doesn't help any. Like it just tells you where things are. Like right there, I can see there are three pink things and one yellow thing. I don't know what that means. I don't know where they are. All I know is that I'm going towards them and hope to God that they that I'm somewhere near them. But other than that, that's really the only help that you can get. To my knowledge, the only way that you get a map of any sort when you buy this game is that it comes in the instruction manual or, you know, like it comes like a fold out or whatever comes with, when, you know, when you purchase the game. But at that point, it, it, it you know, it's not really helpful because you, you, you're not just going to sit there, pause the game every two minutes and then, you know, look into your map or whatever, have to unfold it and then look into it. It's really inconvenient and... You know, having played Vice City first, it, it, it's really, you know, it, it really is annoying that you don't get to, you know, you don't have a map within the game itself. Ugh. Okay, rant over. Let's try to get this mission over with. I really hope I'm, I'm, I'm going where I need to go. Because, again, I don't know Vice City. I don't know Vice City. I don't claim to know it. Okay, there, there's another one. Okay, I'm being shot at. All right, I have one more. I don't know where it is. Oh, god damn it! No, I swear to God, if you flip out, Arrgh! there it is. Okay, can't go in there. Have to go over there, over here. I I think they're still chasing me. I'm not sure. I think the whole point of this mission is that you have to get them to chase you. But uh, you yeah, know, I don't know. I think what I all right. Here's my assumption of this mission because they did they did a horrible job at kind of explaining it. And again, with a lack of a map, you don't really know what you're doing or where you're going. I think what you're, what's what's supposed to happen, oh hell, is that you're supposed to get these three groups of uh, bad guys here. You know, these three cars with the little blue arrows. You have to get them to, oh hell, you have to get them to chase you. Apparently they're pissed. I don't know what we did, but, oh, I think we're supposed, like we have a hit on us or something like that. So they're trying to kill us because you know we, we kind of you know 
All right, all right. I'll, I'll admit we've we've kind of been being dicks like this entire game. I understand that. <laughs> um, so you're trying to get him to chase you, and then you see the yellow blip. I think I'm supposed to go over there. But then again, like I said before, I don't know how to get over there. You know why? That's right, because you don't have a damn map. Like, you don't get a map. You can't, you know, write down a course, you know, like a, like a route or anything like that. No, you just you go towards the little yellow blip, and you just hope to God that you're going the right way. That's all you get. See, like, right now, I have no idea where these guys are. There they are. Hope they don't kill me, because yes, they, they can kill you, and they will kill you. But this entire time, you're trying to make sure that they're still chasing you. While you're trying to make your way over to the ye little yellow blip that you have no idea how to get over to it. Because you don't have a damn map! Oh, God. Ugh. Okay, I think what's supposed to happen here is I saw a bridge. We just went under a bridge. I think I have to go on that bridge. I hope to God I'm going the right way. And I hope to God they're still chasing me because I haven't seen them in a while. Alright, see? Ugh. We just passed a bridge and now I don't know where the bridge is. You know why? Because the infrastructure sucks. Alright, I don't, I, don't, I don't see it. And the and the blip thingy is like right is behind me apparently. Oh my god, this game sucks. All right. <laughs> I know I uh, I hate that I'm I'm coming off as a whiny little bitch, but seriously, <laughs> like this this is such a problem in this game. And for those of you who just who are just joining me, I can show you there there's no map in this game. Like right here, like I can I can pause the game. There's nothing here. No map. There's nothing. You don't get anything. Uh, all right. I think it's supposed to. Let's go this way. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Are these guys still chasing after me. I, I I see their little red blip. Um, to Dead Pixel ninety nine. You can't kill them. I tried that last. Oh crap! Oh, see this. Oh god damn it. See, this is what I get for oh, answering somebody. Oh, damn. Ah! Oh, God. Oh, God. Must find car. Must find car. Must find car. Um, oh, God damn it. <laughs> yeah, see. Um, just so you guys know, you can't... Um, you're not supposed to kill them, as you guys just saw. <laughs> see, this is what I get for paying attention to my comments. <laughs> Yeah, you're not supposed to kill them. You're you're supposed to, from my understanding, because again, the game does a shit job at telling you what to do. My understanding of it was that you have to get the people to follow you. You have to make sure that all three cars follow you, and then you're supposed to take them to this this uh, this other location, which is the yellow blip. So when you start the mission, you have four blips on your radar. You have the um, you have the three pink ones which represent the three cars that you're supposed to get to chase you and then you have the yellow blip which I'm guessing represents where you're supposed to lead them to but you're not supposed to kill them but of course they have no problem killing you and again you don't get a map so you don't most of the time you don't even know where you're going or if you're going the right way which I know I'm gonna say this again just drives the just drives my point that we should have a fucking map. All right, let's try this. One. I'm gonna try this one more time. If not, then screw it. I'm gonna do the other mission because this thing's getting on my nerves. If if I don't, I'm gonna. Here, here's what's gonna happen, guys. Um, I'm gonna try to to complete this mission right now. If I don't complete it right now, I'm gonna go to the other mission. Um, and then before the end of this stream today, I'm going to try to complete the, the this uh, this mission right here. If I hadn't completed it yet, I'm going to try to complete it a, a, a second time or one more time rather. If I don't complete it then, I'm just going to do it off screen um, because I really don't want to sit here and waste a lot of, you know, a lot of your time, you know, trying to do this really annoying mission uh, so we can just get this thing going and... Uh, 
and all that good jazz. All right, so at least now I know where the hell I'm going with this dumb bridge. Have to go over, like, grass and crap. All right, let's make our way. At least now we have a good car. A nice fancy car. And uh, the bridge is out, apparently. Now, this, this thing tripped me up the first time. I wasn't used to this. And I was going full speed, not knowing that the bridge lowers and, you know, goes up and down like this. And I was going full speed. I didn't know the bridge was out. I thought that the bells that, that, that are playing right now, I thought that was like a boat. <laughs> I don't know why, but I thought that when you heard those bells, I thought that's what it meant. Like, oh, it's, you know, just a boat is going underneath the bridge. And I was f going full speed, like, and I just drove off the drove off the bridge because I didn't know that the oh, damn it try to stop I didn't know that the bridge was out and I just end up going god damn it move damn it use your blinkers oh god glare yeah you know because we need more stuff to make this mission even more annoying all right so there's this all right we're, we're, we're nearing a pink blip here oh god this this glare is really gonna get on my nerves all right so we have one guy oh damn it ah! Damn it, move! Oh my god, the whole freaking world wants me dead, I swear to god. Um, we have one following us. Alright, so here's where I, I, I wonder. I'm gonna try something. Oh god, he's like right on my ass. Yep, he's right there. Alright, so here's what we're gonna try to do. I don't know if you're supposed to have all three of them together. So here's the here's the um, the thing here. So I'm gonna bring them here and see if, if, if they can... Okay, good. They're going to take him out. There it is. There it is. Okay. All right. So that makes things a lot easier. I didn't know you could do that. So you can bring them one at a time. Ah, <laughs> silly me. So I think I'm going to be able to... All right. So I understand this mission now. I didn't notice the yellow blip there the first time I, I, I went over here. All right. Now I understand. All right. So hopefully now we'll be able to get through this dumb mission. So I know for a fact that there's one over here. There's one hiding out underneath, um, like, over here by a house. Just chilling for some reason. Oh, God, there's people shooting at me for no reason. Okay, so he sh we're coming up on somebody right now. Sup, dog? Oh, God. Oh, God. All right, is he still after me? Yeah. Okay, so we just have to go... Wait a minute. Yeah, we just have to go over this bridge. Oh, God. He's still after me. He's still after me. Okay, we gotta go up here. Take a left. Right here. Take a right. Oh god. Is he still after me? Okay, I see him. I see him. He's on the. Alright, he's right there. Go in here. And then turn in here. And then make sure that these guys kill him. Oh god. Right there. Booyah, suckers! <laughs> All right, we have one more. Oh, thank God. Uh, see, this is one of the problems that that is naturally going to occur when you're trying to do a live let's play. Because you know, like if I had played this game before, which I haven't, I would have known how to do that. That's sort of one of the one of the I guess negative aspects of doing a live let's play is that. Most of the time, your trial and errors are going to be included in said Let's Play, which, um, give or take, can be rather annoying. Where the hell am I going? Oh, god damn it! Don't tell me I'm... I'm gonna be all lost and stuff for this last one. Okay, so I see the pink blip. Did I miss something here? No. Alright, I think he's just really up this mountain. This mission is giving me a headache. And people are randomly shooting at me. That's not fun. That's not nice. Come on, guys. Come on. Alright, do, I do remember that this last guy is kind of just chilling by one of these entrances. One of these blocked off entrances. Why, why are they blocked off? I don't know. I guess it's just an excuse not to make an, uh, an even bigger world, apparently. Now, one of the things that I will is that Liberty City is actually really, really small. And by small, I mean it's pretty huge, but compared to Vice City and San Andreas, I remember that... There it is. Oh god, U-turn, U-turn, U-turn! Damn it, no! 
Um, when this game, or not, not this game, when Vice City first came out, way back in, I believe it was 2002 or 2003, something like that, the one thing I remembered was uh, one of the things that people kept talking about with the with the new Vice City game, or the, you know, the then new Vice City game, was how much bigger it was going to be compared to, uh, you know, to Liberty City. And one of the things that I remember reading on uh, in an issue of Game Pro, yeah, Game Pro. Anybody remember those? Um, one of the things that I remember reading about it in Game Pro, they were, they were talking about Vice City. Is he's, this guy still after me? I'm over here noticing the um, the radar. He's like really behind. Oh, there he is. Oh crap! Oh crap! Come on, speed up! Speed up! Speed up! He's right there. All right, and uh, one of the things that I remember from Game Pro, reading from Game Pro, was that they said that Vice City is actually physically twice the size of um, Liberty City. And when I played Liberty City, you know, after having played it for like a little while, I I couldn't believe it because Vice City. You know, when you play Vice City, you don't, you know, especially after you've beaten it and things like that, it doesn't seem that big. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong, it, it's still a pretty big city for an open world. Ooh, I just ran over somebody. <laughs> it's still a pretty big city for an open world. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. There it is. Oh, thank God. Boosh. So yeah, that was one of the things that I remembered about um, both about Vice City and about this game. Mind you, when I read that, I, I had never played Grand Theft Auto. As I mentioned before, I actually played, um, or I had never played Grand Theft Auto 3. I mentioned before about how I played Grand Theft Auto uh, Vice City before I ever I, before I ever put my hands on um, on this game. So. That's why I mentioned about how annoying it is that there is no map in this game, because you know I, I I had gotten so accustomed to having one in Vice City. So when I heard that you know when I read that that Vice City or yeah Vice City, this you know the the physical sandbox city in the game was twice the size of Liberty City, it seemed almost baffling. Like I remember thinking to myself, well, how small is is Liberty City, you know? Because, uh, you know, after having played Vice City, it didn't seem that big to me. Um, so that was always something that I that always kind of sparked my interest, I guess, was just knowing that, you know, going into this, that, hey, this, this game isn't going to be as big. Mind you, this game, it, you know, at the time, yeah, it was pretty freaking huge. It was damn impressive. But again, going back, it, it, it definitely, it hasn't aged all that well. And actually, one of the things that I remembered um, was that oh god, and uh, everybody's like honking and stuff like that. Sorry about that. Um, I was actually on my Twitter because apparently some people try to tweet me. Um, I'll get back to them in a bit. So yeah, that, that's one of the things that I noticed is just. Every new game. Oh, here's the here's the interesting part because I always like to kind of put little bits of fun fact trivia and things like that. Uh, if you've been subscribed to me for a while, you know how much I love my trivia. I try to input trivia into every video that I make. So w one of the things here, actually, let's. I'm I'm going to talk about it in a little bit. Let's go ahead and uh, get our new mission here, and then I'll I'll sort of say what I have to say. Hey, my car's still here. Oh my god. And uh, just because I like having fun here. Come on. Huh. Get rid of that. There it is. Holy crap! Thing flipped upside down. Awesome. Because <laughs> we get a new car right there. That's right. Chia boy. Uh, Expresso to go. This guy's still getting beat down. Miguel certainly has some of that famous Latin stamina. I'm quite exhausted. I wonder what she means. Plans for spank. The hell is spank? Far beyond the yard, he's selling it on the street corners. The cartel have a front company, the Kappa Coffee House. They Kappa can sell Coffee spank House. Through the street stalls. We have no choice but to put these drug stands out of operation. Whack. Smash them to splinters. Whack. Okay, so we have to smash them 
to pieces. All right, cruise Liberty's district to find Expresso to go stalls. After you trash the first stall, you will have eight minutes before the cartel warn their pushers. All right, after that, what? See, this is what I don't like about the GTA series. Sometimes they're very, very vague of what, what you need to do. So my basic understanding of this is go beat up some stalls. After that, run. <laughs> oh, God. So, yeah, uh, as I was saying before, one of the interesting things that I was going to talk about was the size. You know, there, there's this... Okay, somebody died for some reason. Um, every new Grand Theft Auto game has obviously been bigger than the previous Grand Theft Auto game. Except between the jump, the jump between Grand Theft Auto Vice City and Grand Theft Auto 4. So, you know, the jump from Grand Theft Auto 3 to Vice City, I, I mentioned it before how... Uh, oh, okay, just... You know, whatever. Just standing right here. I, I mentioned how Vice City was twice the size of um, twice the size of Grand Theft Auto 3, and then from Vice City to San Andreas, I remember them saying how San Andreas was like three times the size of Vice City. But then going from excuse me, sir, going from all right. So I think I I'm supposed to trash this. Okay, what am I doing? What what? Why is it? All right. Huh. Actually, let's try to snipe this guy. I think I'm supposed to do this. Cool. Oh, come on. There it is. <laughs> if you first, when you wait, what is it? If first you don't succeed, just bazooka the hell out of that thing. All right. Okay, here it is. Here it is. Apparently, I'm just supposed to find these random blue blips. But I have eight minutes to do so. Got it. Thankfully, I have a uh, pretty, a decently fast car. Um, so, as I was trying to say... Wait, there it is. One of the things going between... Um, going from... Oh, come on. Going from uh, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas on the PS2 and Grand Theft Auto 4 for the PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360... One of the things that they talked about that I remember was that Liberty City and Grand Theft Auto 4, mind you, it's a next-gen system, or, you know, at that point it was a next-gen system. Um, okay, here it is. All right, so I'm, just, I'm really just supposed to drive around and just find these things. <laughs> I actually didn't think that was going to work. So one of the things that I remember them talking about was that they actually said that Liberty City and Grand Theft Auto 4 was nowhere near the size um, of Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, of San Andreas, the you know the si the state or whatever, and um, I, that that always baffled me, you know, because it's like you'd think that with a uh, next gen system that you would get a much bigger city or whatever, but that wasn't the case. That was one of the only cases, as far as you know, to my knowledge, at least in the 3D Grand Theft Auto games, where it it wasn't you know where that happened, where there was actually a downgrade in the size of a city. So just, like, really interesting stuff. Oh, where's I go? Okay, where the hell? Alright, I see the blue blip. Okay, I think it's over there. Rah! There it is. Hiya! Oh god, oh god, oh god. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Excuse me. There's still an espresso stall in Portland and Shoreside Vale. Oh, god damn it. Oh, don't tell me I have to go over the damn bridge again. Oh, they are... Oh, god damn it. They are... Mm, I don't like that. I really don't like that. Because of... Alright. Son of a bitch. So I think what's going to happen here is that... Um, if you guys don't know, there's three islands. Three main islands. Of uh, Grand Theft... Of, you know, of this game. Liberty City. And I think what's happening here is that there's actually... Um, all right. I think what they just said is that they actually have. Um, am I supposed to go over here? Oh God, I don't know where I'm going. Is that there are stalls in? Is that thing still on fire? Is that there are stalls in um, that we have to get on on those two islands? So we're on one island. We're actually, I think it's, I think we're in like the middle island or whatever. I, I don't know. Um, I think they just mentioned that there are also stalls on those other two islands which would make these things or would make this mission a lot more annoying 
Okay, I think what I'm gonna do here is gonna do that, take a right, and then now we're on this stupid bridge from the last mission. I swear, these missions have been really annoying. See, the problem here is that I don't like this damn timer. That's one of the problems. All right, come on, come on, move out of the way. Move out of the way, there we go. I wonder what happens if if you get stuck on this thing when it goes up. All right, so now we're on Shoreside Vale, which is one of the, um... all right, I'm gonna try something crazy. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, da, da, da. All right, <laughs> didn't work. I was trying to I was trying to go over the side here so I can cut some time. Obviously did not work. Oh Jesus. Oh god. Abort, abort, abort. Oh what the hell? The hell was that? Um That wasn't my fault. Alright, I think I just messed up this mission. <laughs> Holy hell man. I'm just gonna make a prediction and say that I think I'm gonna have to redo this mission. Oh, what the hell? The hell is his problem? Damn. All right, I think the other one's over here. You guys saw that, right? What a dick. Hey, there's a there's a plane over there. Oh, how we wouldn't know that. Hiya! All right, there's six. We have three more to go, I think. Oh, what the hell? I think he's actually trying to get me. Yeah, he's trying to get me. I thought it at first I thought it was just some random pedestrian guy or you know, like a random driver that was just being a dick. I think he's act I think he's trying to stop me. Which you know, makes sense. I'm kind of blowing up his, you know, his crap. But still, man, come on. You're trying to run me over. Come on. Get some sense, brah. Okay, so now... Oh, okay. Excuse me. Um, Alright, I see another blip over here. Hopefully, that'll be the... That'll be it for... Shoreside Vale. I hope. Where are you at, brah? There you are. Let me run into you. Alright, all expressos and Shoreside wrecked. But, we still have, uh, Portland. Yeah, there's still Sprex. See, there he is. What a dick. He's trying to run us over. I mean, honestly. Like, I know I've been going around bazooka and people in the face, but seriously. Trying to run people over? What a dick. That's just a dick move. Oh god. 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 Get out. Oh damn it! I hate this game. <laughs> I really hate this game. Alright guys, I'm going to try one more freaking time. One more time. Um, let me go ahead and get my get my ish here. Alright. Oh god damn it, I have... Uh. For those of you who don't know, um, I'm using... Yes, I am using a cheat code, but that's only to save us time from me having to go um, back to ammunition, which I don't know where in ammunition is. You know why? Because we don't have a freaking map! Um, and I'm just inputting the cheat code here just to save us time. That's the only reason. Oh, crit, crit, crit. That's the only reason I'm doing this. Um, normally I don't use cheat codes in my playthroughs. Um, but this is uh this is really just to take just to save time. All right, I think we have all our crap. Let's uh, go back. You know what? Ugh. I kind of want to and I kind of don't want to do that mission again just because of how annoying it is. But a part of me just wants to do it just to get it over with. So let's go ahead and just, damn it, just get it over with. Um, Jesus, these, these final missions are really becoming a pain. Like I, I went from doing maybe two or three missions per part down to doing maybe one or two if I was lucky. Jesus. Alright, get out the damn truck. So this is what I'm gonna do this time, guys. I'm gonna... Appear oh, oh, no, 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 no. Don't get in the car. Don't get in the car. We have to get our mission first, sir. Come on, Claude. Come on, man. 
Get your A game, dog. Uh. Yes, yes, expresso to go, whatever. So this is what I'm, this is what I'm going to try to do. Um, apparently, and I probably should have done this before. I should I should have known better. Um, apparently, I think the more sensible thing to do here in this situation is to go all the way from Portland, like go to Portland first, and then make my way over to all the islands first. If you guys catch my drift, you guys catch what I'm trying to do here. Stop fighting. Um, so that way I go from one end to of Liberty City down to the other without having to go in between, you know, back and forth and, and all that jazz, I guess. The only problem here is I don't remember how to get to Portland. You know why? Everybody say it with me. Because we don't have a freaking map. Okay, so there, apparently there's like a bunch of stalls here. But I don't want to get those yet. The good thing is that the timer doesn't actually doesn't start counting down until you get like until you blow up the first stall, which is good. I think that they meant to do that so that you have enough time to to go to Portland. I think that that's what they're trying to do here. And I will oblige. Man, that's a big freaking moon. Again, though I have to reiterate, I don't know where Portland is. And you guys already know why. I don't have to say it. Okay. There, there's. I, I remember that there was a mission like similar to this. In um. In Vice City. Good God. There's so many. Oh come on. Move out of the way. All right. Th this is what I'm gonna do, guys. This is what I'm going to do. It says I'm in Tarrington. I think. I'm gonna pull up my damn map here because God damn it, I need it. It says it's ter uh there. Uh, uh, Tarrington. Tearing Ten. Staunton Island. Oh, God. Of course. There's nothing here that tells me where Tearington is. Apparently. Okay, hold up. I, I think I know. Move! Damn you! I think this is the bridge to, to Portland. God freaking Jesus. Get out of my way, people. Um, I think, yeah, I think this is the way to, to Portland, he says, not really knowing. Okay. God damn it, move, people, move. I'm on a mission. I'm trying to blow up stalls. Where the hell am I going? I swear, the, the, the more, damn it, I think I just went the wrong way. Um... I find that the more that this Let's Play progresses, the more senile I've become. You guys know what I'm saying? Like, at the beginning, I was just, like, at the beginning of this Let's Play, I was just like, "Oh, yay, Grand Theft Auto 3! I'm gonna be able to beat it for the first time in my life because I've never ever, you know, I've never been able to beat it because I've never really got into it." You know, I was all chipper and positive, and I'm just like, "Get out my way!" Just, just, God damn it! Uh, where's the bridge? You know, I'm just like getting angry for no reason. Move! <laughs> I'm trying to blow up some coffee stalls, damn it! Alright, I think that this is the bridge. That'd be some ish if I just made like a, one big ass circle. Alright, I think this is Yeah, I think this is it. And, uh, yeah, this is it. Alright, so now this is what we're gonna do, guys. We are going to, um,. Oh god, oh god, oh god, flipping out. Swerve. That was pro right there. Oh god, oh god, oh, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Alright, here we go. Alright, so this is where we go. Oh, okay. First, first things first. We have to, uh... I, I really need to, uh... Get a new car here. I... It was preferable that I have, like, a faster car, but... Given the circumstances, I don't have time. Ain't nobody got time for that. Alright, here we go. So I see a, a stall over here, but instead of ramming it like I've been doing, like a dumbass, um, I'm just gonna just gonna use my uh, my rocket launcher, you know, because that's more civilized. There we go. And now the timer starts. 
And now we just have to find more of these um, these stalls here. And the reason why I decided not to use a um, like just hit it like I've been doing before is because that is um, you know that that takes it's gonna mess up my car. That's basically what we're trying to say. <laughs> it's gonna mess up my car, and then there's gonna be a some time where that douchebag is gonna start chasing me, and uh, you know it's gonna blow my car up, and I'm gonna flip out, and I'm probably gonna die like I did last time, and you know that's not fun for anybody. There we go. Let's peace out. All expressos in Portland. Actually, that wasn't that bad. Um, all right, so now we just need to find our way back to uh, what is it, Staunton Island, whatever the hell that thing is. I want to reiterate, though, I don't know where the damn bridge is. Everybody, say it with me now, because we don't need a fucking map. That's right. That should be my catchphrase from now on for this let's play. I think you can sum it up with one phrase to explain how I feel about this this game. You don't get a freaking map. That 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 should be my that that should be my um my catchphrase for this game. That's right. We don't get a freaking map. I'm gonna put that on t-shirts. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna put that on t-shirts. I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one who gets pissed at this game for not having for not giving you a map. Oh god damn it, where the hell am I going? Okay, here we go. I see bridge. I don't know if See look at this, look at this. Look at look at what I have to do just to get back on the damn bridge. You see this? Like I'm having I'm going over grass and I think that was a police station. I'm getting shot at for no reason. Because you know, apparently I'm in the hood. All right, so I'm Callahan Bridge. Uh, this time I think I should be pretty okay. Man, this handles car handles like complete ass. All right, now we have all those blips. So hopefully it, it's gonna go a little bit better than last time. Um, I don't know if the reason why those blips are showing up now is because we saw them first, and then we, you know, then we're making our way towards them because that didn't happen before. Before you kind of had to just r run into them as you were driving. I'm uh, not sure how that works. All right, so here's one. I'm gonna go into here. This guy's shooting at me, of course. You know, because everybody's shooting at me. All right. Booyah. All right. Apparently, there's a cop somewhere. Screw you, sir. Keep up the good work, though. Just not on me. Hey, oh. Um. All right. So we have a couple blue blips over here. Let's see. By the way, um, oh, no, 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 damn it. Man, this car handles like ass. Seriously. Oh, god damn it. You know what? Let me take this taxi cab. I guarantee you, this taxi cab handles a lot better than than that car. The thing, the, the problem with that car is that the it, it has horrible, horrible brakes and horrible, horrible handling. All right, there's the next one. Yeah. There it is. Apparently somebody saw me, but screw them. There it is. All right. We're doing good, guys. We are doing good. I don't know how well we are on time, but I think this is a much better strategy than the one we had before, which basically amounted to not really having any strategy. And... Hoo All right. That's five. Five, six, seven. Yeah, I think we're good. So we have the, these two. these two that are left... Uh, here on Staunton Island, and then we we make our way over to the uh, the island the other island whatever the hell the name is, Liberty or something I don't, I don't know. There we go. Okay, so we have one more on uh, this island, and then we're gonna make our way over to the to the the final island. I don't know what the name of it is. Can't remember. I can't be bothered remembering names. Oh hell. All right. Apparently, uh, going full force head on with a cop doesn't really amount to anything at least not today which you know what I'm okay with whoa all right so all expressos on Staunton Island wrecked so now we have to go to yeah to Shoreside Vale but of course we have about three minutes to get there move it all right good we have three minutes to get there but uh, guess what I don't know how to get there I mean I kind of I kind of know 
more or less. I can kind of remember how to get there, but we'll we'll see. We'll see. I'm starting to. Okay, there's the bridge. Oh god, damn it. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. No, 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 no. I think that's Liberty City. Or not, what am I talking about? I think that's Port Portland, Portland, Portland Bridge. Oh god, damn it! Move. I'm surprised that guy, that that dick that was trying to shoot us last time. I'm surprised he hasn't come over here and try to shoot us at all. Okay, yeah, that's the um, that's the Portland Bridge. We don't want to go on that. We want to go over here. I saw on the map that it's the one for Shoreside Vale is completely on the opposite side of the Portland Bridge, which was the one that we just saw. So let's go over here. Hopefully, I'm right. We have about two minutes to get there. Which I'm hoping is enough time. I'm really not sure. I hope it is. I really don't feel like doing this mission again. Granted, we you know we have a strategy now, but I really don't feel like like doing it. I think, god damn it, I think that was the bridge. Fuck. Have I mentioned how much it just irks the hell out of me that we don't have a map? Have I said that enough? Do you guys, huh? <laughs> because, really, <laughs> like, the. Uh, I have one freaking minute to get over there, and I can't find the damn bridge. Freaking A. See, all this could have been solved if I just had a damn... Ah! Uh, come on. Where the hell is the bridge? Don't tell me I seriously just went in a complete freaking circle. This better not have been the damn bridge. It was. Freaking A. Now we only have one minute. Ugh. Hate this game. I don't hate this game. I just hate this layout. It makes no sense. Alright, come on. I, I, I don't think we're going to be able to do it, guys. Uh, there's just simply not enough time. Oh my god. Oh my god. Go, 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 go. I, I highly doubt that we're going to be able to make it, but I'm going to try, damn it. I am going to try. I have 30 seconds. You know what? I'm not going to be able to make it. Fuck. Yeah, there, there's no way I'm going to be able to make it. Okay, there's one over there. All right, we're, we're going to try really hard. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? No, 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 not over here. Oh, god damn it. Oh, yeah, we're done. Yeah, we're done. Move, god damn it. Move. And there's, yeah, there's the, oh, god damn it. And now I'm gonna get killed. Ugh. Alright guys, I'm going to try one more time. If I don't get this, then screw it. I'm going to do it off camera. Or, yeah, I'm going to do it offline, if you will. Because, ugh, you guys, ugh, I hate this game. <laughs> oh my god, I hate this game. This, See, I could have avoided this if there was a map. I know, I know I'm sounding like a whiny little bitch every time I say that, but really, there is no reason why a game like this should not have a map. You know what? Screw it. God damn it. Jump. 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 You mother... Okay. This is what I'm going to do. Goodbye, cruel world. It's a lot faster than having to walk back. Uh. Ah. Ah. There it is. It's a lot faster than having to go all the way back. Alright, guys. I'm going to try one more time. If, if I don't make it, then... I'm sorry, I didn't do it. Um, I will do it eventually. I promise you I will. Um, but for now, let's see. We're going to try one more time. This is stupid. I Seriously, I spent this entire part just doing two damn missions. Come on, do it. There it is. 
Do it! There it is. Alright. I'm gonna try one more time. I'm calm. I'm cool. Where the fuck am I? Where? What is this place? I'm lost! Seriously, I'm lost. I don't know where I am. Am I, am I still on, um... Shoreside Vale or whatever? Oh, God damn it. Uh, no, 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 no. Get away from me. You know what? You want your car? Boosh. There you go. Asshole. <laughs> Man, I'm so bitter right now. Oh, I hate this game. I hate this game. I hate this game. But I have to do it. I have to do it. All right, let's go all the way back. This time I'm going to try to get a faster car. Okay, really though, where the hell am I? I, 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 seriously, I, I'm li like really legit lost. No, there's nothing over there. Oh my god. Rockstar, Ugh. you guys are dumbasses. Why don't you put a fucking map in this game? Oh my god, this car handles like ass. Holy hell, this car handles like complete ass. <laughs> I, I'm I'm barely tapping the left and right button and it just swerves everywhere. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm going to have to get rid of this. I can probably get rid of this thing when I get to the mission, though. So, actually, you know what I'm going to do? Alright, this may seem crazy enough to work and it may actually take a while, but actually no, I don't want to do that. Oh god, 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 get out the damn water. Oh hell. Okay, here we go. That was that was that was kinda close. That was too close for comfort. Where the hell am I? You know what? Screw uh forget having a map I think the quote of this entire let's play should be where the hell am I? I I think that's the most appropriate thing in the world <laughs> where the hell am I? <laughs> I I think that really summarizes my, my my issue with this game no map no direction no way of knowing where to go no help from the game I think it I think it's perfect where the hell am I? It's good. It, it, it's, it's good. Alright, so I'm going to try this one more time, guys. If I fail this, I'm going to call it a day, and then I'm going to do this off-camera. Because f forget this game. This game is stupid. This mission is stupid. The map is stupid. The infrastructure is stupid. Rockstar is stupid for not having a freaking map in the game. And I don't want to deal with this. <laughs> it's like a stupid game. It's a damn stupid game. All right, let's keep going. Uh, see, this this the this, uh, see this is the kind of crap that doesn't make me want to play this game anymore. All right, there's a I'm trying to see if I can if I can uh, make the make these uh, little blue blips pop up, so it makes it easier when I come back to this place move don't hit my car I swear to God move God people Jesus you guys are idiots brains do you has it actually all right so I'm seeing okay so there's two in Portland there's two in Shoreside Vale that makes for four there are four blips right here that's eight there's one there should be one more it's not pumping up Torrington. Oh, okay. All right, we got it. We got it. All right, so now we just need to find the stupid bridge to Portland. See, th this this is the problem here. My my issue with this game is entirely rev well, besides the stupid map system or lack thereof, is um the fact that I never know where the damn bridges are because you always have to go back and forth between um between all these different islands, 
And this stupid fog is not helping much. This is like kryptonite Superman 64 levels of fog here. Really not helping. Come on, game. I know you hate me, but Jesus. I, I am... I'm convinced that this, this game does hate me. It has to, because... Jesus Christ. I've taken so much crap from this game. Honestly, I, I, I cannot wait. And this is the first time I've ever said this about a playthrough that I've done. Because, you know, usually I have a lot of fun play, you know, playing these games and putting them up. My review, either reviews or, like, let's plays or whatever. I usually try to have fun with them. But my god, I, I just cannot wait till this game is over. I, I have not enjoyed myself nearly as much as as I thought I would playing this game. I just cannot wait till, till this game is over. You guys have no idea. This game just isn't fun for me. I, it, it's, it hasn't aged well at all. In my opinion. I know I know, I know people are going to be like, rah, rah, rah. One of the best games on PS2. Rah, rah, rah. And I, you know, I get that, but really though. Good lord. Alright, this is what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to, um, because I already know where all, well, most, you know, the blips are already there in place for, um, for the short, not short side veil, for the Staunton Island. I'm, I, I know I just passed by a, uh, a blue blip here, but um, I'm going to find the other one because I don't want to waste time having to look for this stuff. And I think it's, it should be over here, if I remember correctly. There's only two on in Portland. Yeah, so there's one over here, and then there's one back that way. So, what I'm going to do... Oh, hell. So I'm just going to have to... Boosh, because these guys are shooting the hell out of me. Alright. So now we have it. I don't know why the... Oh, wait. That's right. I tried to kill the Mafia. Ah, that's why. I was going to say, I don't, I don't know why the Mafia is trying to kill me. But yeah, that's right. I tried to kill them. My bad. All right, so the other one should be over here. I'm try If you guys aren't, if you guys are wondering what I'm trying to do here, is I'm trying to make it as linear as possible with this mission. I think that's what's going to have to happen. Um, try to cut corners as much as possible. Oh come on! There it is. So now we just got to make our way over to the bridge, which should be over here. Keyword should, because knowing this game, it's probably going to. Pick the damn thing up and relocate it somewhere else. Just to fuck with me. Alright, so there's the bridge. Let's go over here because we don't want to go into incoming traffic because we know that's going to screw me over. Alright, here we go. Here we go. We're going to do it this time, guys. We are definitely going to do it. This game is giving me a headache. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, so we're now on Staunton Island. All the blips are there. So we shouldn't have that much of a that much difficulty trying to find all the blips, all the different uh, places that we need to go and stuff like that. I, I say this, you know, theoretically speaking, because again, this map sucks. And uh, it could just be that they'll just end up picking the stuff up and uh, relocating it somewhere completely different. Okay, there we go. Move, sir. I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission to get rid of this, or to finish this stupid mission. That's right. All right, here we go. I think having this car definitely makes a big difference. I think my one of my mistakes early on was um, getting rid of it and relying on that other crappy car that had horrible, horrible, horrible uh, handling. Oh, damn it. No, 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 no. We're going to move up. And then the other one's right here. There we go. All right, that's four. There's three more uh, here on Staunton. That should get us to uh, eight. No, there's. Wait, what? <laughs> I cannot count. Point is, there's, there's three blips here, and we need to get them. <laughs> That's basically all you need to know. All right, so there's one over here. There it is. Oh god, there's a cop right there, and he didn't care. That's awesome. And there's one over here. Hope the cop doesn't care. He shouldn't though, because he's a dick. Alright, there we go. And like I said, cop didn't care. 
Then there's one more. So far we're doing good, guys, but again, anything can happen with this stupid game because it's stupid and the map is stupid and I hate this game. Have I mentioned how much I hate this game? Because I do. I really do. I hate this game. I really can't wait till I'm done with this. So I don't ever have to touch this game again because it's so horrible. There it is. Alright, so now we're at 7. Now we need to go and find the damn bridge. Which one you say? Oh, the one that's going to get us to the other island. But of course, as I mentioned before, so many times, I don't know if I'm going to be able to find it. Because last time we tried to get there and guess what? Took it to the wrong place. You know why? Yeah, that's right. Because there's no fucking map! Alright, I think it should be this one over here. I'm completely guessing. Yeah, I think it should be this one. It should be, anyway. Because, again, I don't know. Belleville Park? Yeah, uh, yeah, okay. Awesome. We're, we're on the right path. We are on the right path here. If I find another car, preferably like this, that's um, fairly decent. You know, it would be some crap if... Uh... Oh, God. Wait. Oh, hell. Go, 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 go. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> I totally didn't mean for that to happen. Well, at least now we found out what happens if you... Uh... What happens if you uh, if you land on that thing? Okay, if I if memory serves me correctly, the dick that tries to kill us is gonna be popping up somewhere around here. He's gonna try to kill us because this is always the place that he pops up in, and uh, we have all right. We have this one guy over here. We should kill him. Oh god damn it! No 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 no. There it is. All right, now we should have one more, and we have two. Well, oh god damn it! Ugh. No, 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 no! Come on, run, you piece of shit! All right, there it is. Man, I'm getting vulgar in this episode, aren't I? Or in this part? But seriously though, I am so done with this mission. I am seriously so done. I swear to God, I need a car. I need any car. Give me any car. I just need. It. There it is. I just need to get over there. The worst thing in the world would be if I. If I didn't, if I failed this mission because I wasn't fast enough, and there's the dick. There he is. I don't know. I think he appears once you have like the last one, like the last stall or whatever they have to get. All right, come on, go up there. God damn it, I got, I picked the wrong car to do this. We have two minutes left. We have a dick on our, on our. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say we have a dick on our ass. That's not right. Um, but if I remember correctly, he's. It should be up here. Oh dear Jesus. Oh God. Come on. Go, 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 go. Go. For the love of God, please go. I just want to be done with this mission. I hate this mission. I hate this game. Oh God. There it is. There it is. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Alright, come on. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. There it is. What? Oh, okay, God. Jesus Christ. I Like, the thing didn't stop, and the timer was still going. Oh, my God. I hate this mission. <laughs> hate this mission. I hate this stupid game. Oh, my God. All right, guys. I, I, I'm going to have to end it there. I, I've, I think I've gone way past the amount of time that I was going to go for. I've been doing this for, like, over an hour now. So... Uh, thanks again for for joining me. If, if you joined me live, uh, thanks for watching. If you if you're watching this in the future, once I upload this part to YouTube, um, I know there's been a lot of bitching in this part, but seriously though, like oh my god, I hate this game. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I mean no, I, I have to reiterate because people are gonna be 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 saying mean things about me and gonna be taking things out of context. This game is good. It's it's definitely good. It's just I'm so used to having a map, and you guys don't understand how much how much more difficult it is not having one and maybe that's just me being spoiled but with some of this stuff really though like it, it would make things so much easier so much more convenient if you just had an in-game map just just an in-game map even if you can just you know 
access it you know at your hideout or something like it's maybe you know even if you can't access it just by pressing start or whatever the fact that you don't have a map really really makes a lot of these missions really annoying because you don't know where to go and there's nothing in the game that tells you where to go because you don't have a map all you have is a radar and that's pretty much useless because you know what's good what good is a radar if you don't know where any of the landmarks are in the in the radar itself the radar map is so small that most of the time you don't really get any good use out of it so I again I'm gonna keep saying it because it's still gonna be a you know it's gonna continue being a problem going forward that yes I, I don't like this I don't like Grand Theft Auto 3 it's definitely the weakest entry in the entire Grand Theft Auto series on the PS2 and the Xbox all right, but I promise in the future that I'm not in, in future parts I'm not going to bring it up as much as I did this time just because the the, the two missions that we did this time uh, Would have just gone a lot more smoother uh, I could have gone, you know, I could have been done with them a lot faster if we just had a map But anyway guys, uh, thank you for joining me. Thank you for following me along I know that this you know this gameplay kind of drags on because I don't know what I'm doing uh, That's usually not my style, but that's how it is, you know, that's what I, I plan to do. So anyway, thank you guys for joining me. Um, I Again, as always, if you like this, uh, be sure to follow me on Twitch. If you want to watch the rest of the parts, um, we are up to part 10 right now. So there's nine more parts before this one. Be sure to go over to my YouTube channel at Johnny Crimson 2000 um, on YouTube and follow me on Johnny... Um, well, go to YouTube to, to watch all the parts and then go to my Twitter at Johnny Crimson 2K. Um, to follow me and find out what's going on and to see um, I post on there when I'm going live so if you ever want to join me live when I record this stuff go on there so you can catch up and uh, yeah a lot of fun send me a message I like chatting um, I'll say hi I'm not mean I don't bite so anyway guys I'll talk I'll, well, I'll talk to you guys later I will see you guys in my next video alright peace out